Hey guys, welcome back to Ignite Fitness. Hope you're all feeling amazing today and ready to tackle our next workout. Today's workout is an at-home push day. So if you don't know what a push day is, it's typically targeting your triceps and your chest, so any movements that are causing a pushing effect on the muscles, okay? Let's get to it. What you need for today is a challenging set of dumbbells. So whatever you have in your arsenal today in mind, I have a set of 10s, a set of 15s, and a set of 20s. You grab whatever you have at home and feel comfortable using. Make sure you have your water on hand and let's begin. We're just gonna start by doing some chest openers just to warm up the body. We are gonna use rep work today, so we're gonna do three sets, 10 reps in each set, okay? Beautiful, guys. Opening everything up. Go up and across the body. Just bringing some heat to those muscles, right? We don't wanna do anything without a little bit of a warm up. Open. Open nice and wide, stretching out those muscles. Beautiful. Take the arms overhead and down. Just warming up the whole shoulder girl as well. Shoulders are always working to stabilize the weight, so we want to stay warm from every angle. Beautiful, guys. And now let's just take our hands over our head, coming into a little tricep stretch. We're going to keep this nice and dynamic since it's just the warm up, not the cool down. And we're going to move through that nice and quick. Just bringing some heat to those muscles and preparing them for work. Two more. Last one. Beautiful, guys, shake the whole body out and we're gonna come on down to the mat. First things first, we've got a chest press. So I'm gonna go for my heaviest weight. I've got 20s today. I'm gonna plant my feet on the mat. Come on down, holding my weight safely. Turning the elbows out. So if the weights are parallel to the body, palms facing out, strong supported wrists, we're going to push up, squeezing those chest muscles, the pectoralis, mu pectoralis muscles, as we squeeze those weights up. Are we ready guys? Here we go, going for 10. Three, two, one. Belly tight, held in. Take your time with these. We really want to work both the up and the down. Here's five. You should be moving really nice, slow, and controlled movements. Here's nine, last one, all the way up, and slowly bring it all the way down. Beautiful, set the weights down before you roll on up. Setting one weight out of the way. I'm going to use one weight for our next move. It's overhead triceps extension. So I'm going to take that weight safely over my head, taking it over my body. I've got my elbows locked in nice and tight, taking that weight down, and I'm going to extend it up over my head, keeping that belly in tight. Here we go guys, three, two, one. Lower and push it up. Here's five. Control it guys, don't let that weight drag you. Two more all the way. Stay strong, stay strong. And take that weight overhead. Beautiful, guys. Set it down, grab a sip of water, take a little bit of a rest. Whew. That is round one. So we're gonna do that, repeat that two more times before we move on to our next sleeper set. You're doing great, guys. As fun as it is to do like a really dynamic total body workouts or the boot camps or the cardio days, it is still so good for our bodies to have these more targeted workouts to really strengthen one or two muscle groups and get the most out of that workout. Come on back down for our chest press. Sticking with the heavy weights. Listen to your body, guys. At any point, if your body's telling you this is too much, we need to drop down, drop down. If your body's telling you this is way too easy, time to get some heavier weights. Turn those wrists out. Plant those feet, 90 degree angle. Three, two, one. Press those weights up and squeeze. Take it 
Take your time. Squeeze that chest. We've got three to go. Three, two, last one. Stay strong, stay strong. Press it all the way up and all the way down. Set those weights down safely before you roll up. Moving one weight out of the way. Back up for tricep extension. Grab that weight, it is a superset, so there's no real rest between these movements. Take that weight overhead, find your form. Three, two, one. Belly in tight. Extending those arms overhead, keeping those elbows locked as close together as possible. Don't let them splay out. And that'll be instinctual as it starts to get hard. Your elbows will want to extend. Don't let them do that. Two to go. Last one. And bring it down. Set the weight down, have your sip of water. One more time. You're doing amazing, guys. I know that it is challenging when we start to bring in targeted workouts, especially if it's not something that you're used to. A lot of home workouts will target the total body, especially when we're doing bar, Pilates, like the Zoom bar, and kind of dance workouts. It's targeting everything, right? It's not a specific movement. So this is really good to prepare your body and really concentrate on those muscles for muscle growth. All right, guys, back down to the mat. Grabbing those heavy weights. Last time with our chest press and tricep extensions. Here we go. Take those weights out nice and wide, belly in. Plant the feet. Three, two, three. One, let's drive those weights up. Remember, slow and controlled here. Taking your time as you lower, taking your time as you press up. Squeezing those chest muscles together, envisioning what you're doing. You're squeezing those muscles. Here's seven. We've got three to go. Come on, guys, you can do this. Push it up, push it up. Last two, and one. Drive it all the way up, lower it down slow. Beautiful, guys, set those weights down. Roll it on up. Last time, triceps extension. I'm not gonna lie, these feet are starting to feel spicy. Take that weight overhead. Find your form, belly in tight. Three, two, one. Drop it down and squeeze it up overhead. Use your breath, guys. Ex exhale on the extension. Three to go. Three. Last two. And one. Bring that weight down and over. Beautiful, guys. Set the weight out of the way. Moving to our lighter set. So you guys take your rest, have your water. I'm gonna demo our next move. We're gonna go into a chest fly. So just so I'm not crashing into the wall, I'm gonna turn my body away from you guys. So, planting my elbows, I got my body down. Knees at 90 degree angle once again. I'm gonna extend my arms over my chest. This time, instead of going up and down, we're gonna lengthen our lever and we're gonna go open. And as we come up, we're gonna squeeze that chest up. Are we ready, guys? Find your weights, find your position. Take those weights up overhead, three, Two, one, going for 10. Open and squeeze those muscles together. Exhale on the way up. Keep that belly locked in tight. Last two, one, and two. Come all the way up and all the way down. Release those weights. Beautiful, guys. Switching it over, coming back up to standing. Our next move is a tricep kickback. We've done these tons of times in our workouts. So bending at the waist will draw those weights up and press them back. Here we go, belly locked in tight for 10. Three, two, one. Kick those weights back. 
control them. Whenever we're doing these targeted workouts, I want you to think about slowing things down and controlling the contraction. Here's six, seven, eight, nine, last one here, and lower it down. Beautiful guys, set the weights down, grab your sip of water. You're doing great. Round two, we got this. We're gonna have such a nice tricep pump after this. Our chest is gonna feel strong. We're gonna look amazing. All right, guys, slowly coming on down back for our chest fly. Set it up, take your time. Plant those feet at 90 degree angle. Walk it down low, safely picking up those weights. Let's drive them up. Overhead, here we go, three, two, one for 10. Open, squeeze them up. Beautiful guys, let that breath guide you. Focus on the muscles that you're squeezing together. Really feel them contracting. Four to go. Here's four, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Three. And our last one here, all the way up, all the way down. Beautiful. Slowly come on up. I actually think I'm gonna switch to my 15s for my tricep kickbacks. I'm feeling like today, my triceps can handle a little bit more. Ready right, guys, lock that belly in tight. Hinge at the hips, roll those weights up. Let's kick it back in three, two, one, let's go. Find that little bit of hang time. Control those weights. Here's four, five, last two, and one. Beautiful guys, set the weights down, grab your sip of water. Don't forget to challenge yourself, guys. Like, right? I had it started with 10s. I knew my body could handle more. I picked up the 15s, and I was right. And it's worth it. It's worth the challenge. I'm actually going to challenge myself a step further. I'm going to try the 15s for my chest fly this time. And if you're someone who's used to working out at a gym, and you think, oh, on the pec deck, like I can lift more than I can with dumbbells. Remember, when you're using free weights, it requires so much stability in other muscle groups than when you're working like a closed circuit machine. Alrighty, so don't feel bad if you're not chest flying as much as you would on a machine at the gym. Plant those feet. Find that position, back, low back's pressed into the mat. Take those weights overhead, three, two, one. Going for 10. Squeeze, take your time, don't rush things even though you want it to be over with, right? You want to still take your time and control everything. Here's five. Come on, guys. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Challenge your body. What can it do? What can you make it do? Let's see it. Two. Last one here. All the way up and all the way down. Beautiful. I love that. I'm so happy I challenged myself with the 15s. It felt great. It was definitely more of a challenge. I had to strain to talk, but that's okay because if this, you guys have been working out with me for a while, you know sometimes I'm difficult to understand. <laughs> Bending at the waist, hinge those hips back, lock that belly in, row the weights up, tricep kick kickbacks. Three, two, one, let's go. Here's five, six, seven, last one, beautiful, set the weight out of the way, 
All right, guys, this time we're coming in to a narrow chest press. So we're still gonna come down on to our mat, same position. I'm just trying to think about what I wanna try here. I might stick with my 15s for this one. I will demo. So I'm gonna come down on my back. Instead of taking the weights out wide, I'm gonna bring them together right on top of my chest. And as I press up, I'm gonna keep those weights together. So I'm working on more of uh, the closer chain of my pectoralis muscles. Here we go, guys. Three, two, one. Drive those weights up. Squeeze them down. Control them on the way down. You don't want to hit yourself in the sternum with these weights. So you want a weight that's not overdoing it. Here's six. Come on, four more guys. Press them up. Four. Three. Two. Last one. Woohoo! Push them up and bring them down. Beautiful guys. Set those weights down before rolling on up. Those are spicy. I love it. No weights for this one, guys. We're gonna come into our most famous, most well-loved tricep dips. Plant those feet, plant those hands. Fingers facing the bum. Press the hips up towards the sky. We're gonna bend through the back of the arms and squeeze it up for 10. Here we go. Three, two, one. Let's go. Press it up. Drive through those palms. Make the back of the arms work. Here, seven, eight, Almost there, almost there. <laughs> Last one. Woo! <laughs> oh, I'm definitely feeling it, guys. I hope you are too. And I hope you're feeling good. I like, like to do a periodic check. I always keep a mirror behind the camera for when I am training you guys. I like to see my own form and so that I'm teaching you guys properly. Sometimes if I'm not watching myself, then I can lose my form too. So I want to instruct you guys properly. But I do the vanity in me checks my muscles periodically in the mirror behind you. <laughs> Sip of water. We're gonna come back to that narrow chest press. Are we ready? Let's pick up those spicy, spicy weights. I am definitely sticking with the 15s for this one. Here we go, planting those feet, bringing those weights close together. Smush them together, keep them together the whole time. Three, two, one, let's drive them up.
Here's five. Come on, push it up, push it up. Four. Last one here, guys. Come on, stay strong, stay strong. Drive it up and down. Beautiful. Set those weights out of the way. No press is done. Take it. Set it up. Set up for our tricep dips. Plant those feet. Plant those palms. Drive them up. Three, two, one. Take it down. Push through those palms. Halfway. Come on. Beautiful guys, drop your bums, release it, grab a sip of water. I'm going to demo our next little bit. We are nearing the end of this workout. I know it's a challenge, but you are doing amazing. Alrighty, grab your toes, from your knees, it doesn't matter. We're going to do push-ups to tricep push-ups, okay? So this is going to be a really fatiguing round. Both sets of muscle groups have worked really hard already. So if at any point you need to drop, drop. You need to do micro movements, do micro movements. Just go as hard as you can, okay? Planting those hands wide. We're gonna come first into our classic push up. Chest down, press it up for 10. Three, two, one, let's go. Make sure the weights are safely out of the way, guys. You're not hurting yourself. Here's four. Three, two, last one, and press it up. Sink it back for child's pose to release a little pressure. So triceps press up looks a little different. I'm gonna come straight for my knees. Taking those hands a little closer together. Instead of taking the elbows out, we're gonna track them directly back into the ribs. Pressing up so it's all coming from the back of the arm. Are we ready guys? For 10, let's do this. Three, Two, one, down and up. Eight, seven, come on guys, stay strong. Last one. Beautiful guys, think it back. Release into child pose if you need to. Otherwise, meet me up on the mat. That is our chest and triceps workout. I know I scared you. I know you thought you were gonna have to do a full round of that, but we worked hard today. All right, take the hands out in front of you. Take them all the way around behind your back. Interlace the fingers, open up the chest. <sighs> I love this one. Extending the arms back, elevating them as high as they can go so you can really open up to the heart. <sighs> Walking that belly in nice and tight. Ah, beautiful. Taking the head overhead, let's release some pressure from the triceps. Beautiful guys, I hope you enjoyed this workout. If you want to see more targeted workouts, please let me know in the comments or direct message me on Instagram. That works too. But I'd love to know your feedback. I'd love to know what you guys enjoy doing or what you're looking for more. Beautiful, drop it down. Let's just come into some nice spinal rotations. One side looking out over the shoulder. And twist the other way. Beautiful guys, if you need to have more of a stretch, there's plenty of stretching videos and yoga videos on the channel. Drink lots of water today. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a beautiful day, guys. Enjoy your little home. See you guys on the mat again tomorrow. Bye, guys.